When you want to make a call, your phone sends a signal to the nearest network tower. The signal then goes through a series of steps to reach the tower closest to the recipient of your call. Finally, the signal is sent to the recipient's phone, allowing you to start talking. As for emergency calls without service, most SIM cards operate with GSM technology, which allows you to use another service provider's network when your service provider's coverage is unavailable. Your phone will connect to a roaming network. These networks have links with your service provider. Even if your roaming network signal is weak, your phone will connect to the best network signal available in your area, regardless of which carrier it belongs to. Emergency calls can still be made in this scenario, ensuring help can be reached when needed. Remember, your SIM card only contains your phone number and carrier information, so it's possible to make an emergency call even if your SIM card is broken. Although the emergency service center may not receive caller ID or location information, the call can still be connected.